thought by the goalkeeper. Can Wolves do what Blackburn did to them? It's Hunt! Oh, it's beautiful! Hello! Hi, hello. Welcome to day nine of the Old Gold Advent. I'm Tom Rouse. Wolves, of course, playing Sunderland this afternoon. Uh, hopefully, it'll be a great win for us. Uh, so here's... But anyway, today I'm talking about a rather sombre occasion at Molyneux um, from two years ago, nearly three years ago now. It was the game against Blackpool in January 2015, the week that Sir Jack Hayward passed away. We had a game the day that he died against Fulham, uh, which ended in Wolves losing on a penalty shooter. But then the game where we paid our full respects was a, a game against Blackpool and... Not only was it a great occasion in terms of the old players that came onto the pitch and the the respects that were paid to Sir Jack and the balloons that were laid into the air and stuff like that, uh, it was a great performance by a team and it was we had to really grind it out against a poor Blackpool team. But Dave Edwards scoring, Benica Phobe scoring a really simple goal. I think it was his first goal for Wolves as well. Started that momentum that nearly got us towards the playoffs at the end of that season, but. One memory from that game, and it's a really touching memory, was when they released the balloons at the end of the minute. Applause, or I think it was. Uh, there was a handful of balloons that crept underneath the Steve ball. And I remember my auntie saying after the game, it was as if Sir Jack just didn't want to leave. And I often watch that video of the uh, the memorial and get a little bit choked up about it. So, yeah. Um, let me know your memories of that game as well. It was not an exceptional game, but for quite a sombre occasion and, a, and to remember a great man that, who did a lot for the Wolves. And yeah, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and let me know your memories, not just today of uh, that game, but of Sir Jack Hayward as well. Of course, there's that moment, isn't there? See you tomorrow.